If anyone's been there to see the rise and fall of players in this team, it's the guy who's been driving them around for 11 years. My name's Grant Kelly, but everyone calls me Grunter. And I'm the All Blacks dedicated bus driver. My job's fairly simple. Don't be late, don't get lost, and have the coach nice and tidy. Get a haircut today, but yeah. Across the road. No, no, down there. All right. Hey, Is he? Israel Dagger is the most untidiest room. Yeah, this protocols, you know, the, the new boys uh, all come in the front door. As they get more games under their belt, they move closer to the back. Uh, when you get down to the very back, you got the, the old hands, and in front of the back seat is Kieran Reed. Rido, he can't get the back seat because he's skipper. Well, I don't know why that is, really, but that's the way it is, so that's the way it is. It's a lot of time spent on the bus to trainings twice a day, sometimes four times a day, you know, you're on the bus. And... Jordy, yo, Jordy, yeah. Music! Music! You said a music committee at the start of each year, normally the younger boys who it's not a job you really want. <laughs> it's pretty tough to, to get it right. If it's not going well, then the boys will, will certainly let them know. Sort of boom, boom, bang, bang music. You'll have Steve Hansen sort of saying, change the song. And uh, the backseat don't like it, they'll certainly uh, voice their opinion. Severe and uh, TJ Pranara. Unfortunately, uh, I have to sit by them as you'll catch them doing their rap battles. Izzy Dag thinks he's a bit of a rapper. And he's rubbish, obviously. Um, but yeah, no, nah, it's it's a special place. It's a special place being on the bus. Together,